Hello everyone, my name is Mr. Nail King and welcome back to Let's Play Final Fantasy V. Yeah, welcome. Alright, so last time we uh, we fought Gilgamesh. That's pretty much it. But um, now we gotta go find that dude who like, saved us. Okay, where are we supposed to go? Oh, we have to go below. Okay, I'm like, I was so confused. It's like, wait, what? I've only recorded like ukulele this week. Like that is it. Well, no, I recorded Spyro Monday too. It's Wednesday now, so I recorded ukulele yesterday. I recorded quite a bit of it, but now that I have three, yeah, I guess I rest up. Wait, is this beforehand or what? No, okay. But um, so I recorded a bunch of that. I have no idea when you guys will be getting this video. I'm gonna be straight up. Like now that I'm doing three let's plays at a time. I, the, my schedule's gonna get so out of whack. I'm gonna have such weird... I have no idea. If you already grabbed the other side of this box, would you? Oh, okay. But I have no idea... Like, what is gonna happen to my schedule. Like, there's no way I'm gonna be able to keep up a schedule. Like, I'm gonna have to switch out certain games, things like that. We're off. This is absolutely... This is an awesome part of the game. So you're on this submarine thing here. And, you know, like, you get to explore the underwater part. It's only a decoy. The real plan is to get the barrier tower by the submarine. Oh man, this I absolutely love this part of the game. This is such a cool part of the game. I'm so excited. Like I'm just super excited because it's so fun. So alright. And come on. Alright. Now I remember what you have to do up ahead here, but I have no idea if I'm gonna be able to remember. Like what it, who should go where because like it's like the hardest part about it is remembering who goes to which side but oh well i thought my screen was all messed up there i looked over i saw black and i was like oh wait no that's just the side of the screen so oh man we're getting really far in this game though like geez we're about to take down the barrier indeed all that's left is to take it out and the barrier will be destroyed so that means we're actually believe it or not after this part we pretty much only have one dungeon left in this world and we're done with the second half of the game then pretty much we got whisper weed it's pretty much a uh, a way to stay in contact with each other i i really enjoy playing games like this because like i don't need as much like reading or things like that i can't explain what's going on easier like ukulele i had trouble because of the fact that like because we i had to do the um not talking but man what am i trying to say now geez like, yeah, I actually had to read because I'm playing it blind. Like, playing games that aren't blind are pretty fun just because of that reason alone sometimes, so. But, man, they really jip you on the XP here, huh? Let me check. Like, we have, like, next to no health. Jeez, man. I may have to do a bit of farming at some point in this game. Like, only 445 XP at this point in the game. And I haven't even mastered anything yet. However, the gill is a welcome sight for sure. So, let's go ahead and keep on fighting through here. Luckily, this makes uh, random battles go much faster here. So we got a trap. A red dragon. This will be interesting. I'm going to actually do this. So we can throw. I'm not going to throw any of that stuff in. Just go ahead and attack and see what's up. Well, a red dragon. I would imagine Blizzara would be its weakness, but who knows. I haven't played this game forever. Yeah, okay. Good enough. So I, I've gotten a lot of messages saying, like, you know... My, my gameplay is, like, all over the place. Like, I'm not that good at the game. And I know I'm not. I'm, um, I'm pretty terrible at this game. I know I am. Uh, but that's part of the thing about my, uh, my Let's Plays is I'm very much just a relaxed Let's Player who plays through games casually. If you've come here looking for, like, a walkthrough or anything like that, like, you've come to the wrong spot, so. Alright, there we go. We got him there. Ooh, and we all gained levels. A blood sword. Who could use that? I'm trying to actually think who could use it. Can she use the blood sword? No, she cannot. But I actually just realized who can. I was wrong. He can't either. Oh, wait. Who can use the blood sword then? Hold on. Let me think. Oh, uh, let's see here. Let's take a look. Blood sword. Saps targets HP. Well, who could use that? Okay, I'm just going to go through and do like the auto equip and see who can use it. Oh, gold I didn't realize I had one of those. Alright, well, I'm just gonna leave it in my inventory for now, and I can come back to it later on, so. <clears throat> Preemptive strike. Get out of here. Oh, we gained a job level. Who, wait, I think Bart's? No, Lena did. Okay, so she's level 3 white magic. Can I go back to... 
Let's try and do this. What do I want to do? Level 5, level 3. Let's make her like a, uh... Yeah, let's do this. Let's make her like a white mage type thing. And she can use the blood sword. Let's see, can she use a Suna? That's the only thing I want. <sighs> Man, what level do they need possibly? I, I, I'm just gonna master it out. I'm just gonna master it. Yeah. Let's just master this one. Just because I'm like, I don't know what she could possibly need to do all that. Oh man, this is like disorientating, dude. Okay, so I... Okay, let's go to the left. Oh, there's stairs. This is... This screen is so disorientating. So, jeez, man. <clears throat> we are getting some... It's not incredible XP. It's, it's XP. I'll say that. But it's not enough that I need to, like, continue on. Gather Reflect Knight. Oh my goodness. Uh, let's see here. Fifth floor. Alright, let's... See, I saw the stairs that time because I know what I'm looking for. Did I say it's- yeah, it's Wednesday. I have, like, nothing left this week. Like, yesterday I had two tests. I got through the tests, and they were- they went well. So I, that, like, takes the stress right off my so shoulders then. Kind of like last Wednesday or two Wednesdays ago when I had tests. Ksh, golf green. Ksh, over. It's like, what the freak? It's like they're trying to, like- this is, like, when they started trying to go towards the idea of steampunk. I guess. <clears throat> then he's made it to the generator. All right. Uh oh! Watch out behind you! Whoa! And that works. <laughs> and just zaps him just like that. Don't worry about it. Just get a roof as fast as you can. All right. So we're on our way. We're doing. We're making great time, man. We're making freaking great time. This this video. <laughs> making up for all that terrible timing that I got the past two videos <laughs> Finally, like I said, I'm sorry about whenever this comes up. I I, I do apologize in advance um, Recordings gonna be kind of strange now in general. Okay, here we are now. We're talking we've Reached the antenna So we've got boss fight coming up here then Thank God I, I need I needed her to be a uh, white mage because I the ti like at this point in the game, you get so many strange like side effects that attack you, or, or not side effects. You get so many like weird debuffs and stuff like that. As soon as the only way to like fight it, don't let me like that jingle. I forgot my cat just like lackadaisically like laying off, off the side of my bed. Uh oh, at most. So this guy is uh bad news with his common attack that he gets to go twice with. But nothing we can't handle. Comet. You and your comet, dude. Holy cow, you using two comets? What is this? Let's see, let's see what fire it does. Let's see if it does any damage. I feel like magic probably won't do much. Yeah. Not much in the way of magic here. However, let's see what Thundara does. No, I think all magic's gonna do about the same, honestly, here. So. These comet attacks take forever. Mystery Waltz. Why do we get the mystery wall? It's always that same stupid dance where she gets 40 MP, boy. 40 MP. I've been thinking about going to, uh... Since, like, Friday's right around the corner, I really want to go to, uh, Little Caesars. They finally just opened a Little Caesars. I don't want to say close. It's it's not close. It's actually pretty far away. It's, like, <laughs> probably a 45-minute drive. And it's like, do I really want to drive 45 minutes for pizza, you know? Or is this the commercial says, pizza, pizza. You and your freaking, you and your freaking comment, boy. Your comment, yeah, your comment, your comment. There we go. You and your comment, boy. Your comment. This isn't the part I was thinking of, though. This is actually different. Uh, there's another part later on that we have to go to, and maybe you'll see it next time. Cause this isn't the end of the the thing. The um the level or the end of the world like i was saying the world like we're playing super mario bros oh i got him okay <laughs> and then you got the disintegrating theme there it just disintegrates 12 abp and got dark matter all right well i guess that's it we destroyed the antenna but how do we get out of here they say isn't the entire tower gonna come crashing down though that's how it's done. 
Uh oh. Hey, he's not getting out of there. Hurry up, make your escape. Energy field. The energy feed's gone inside a recursive loop. So, yeah, everything's gonna blow up. Go figure, because that's how everything goes. But I don't know, I think I'm gonna try getting most users this Friday. So. Don't need to come down here. So, yeah, go figure. He dies. Whoa. So, yeah, go, we, I feel like everybody, I mean, at least I saw it coming. It's like, yeah, he's definitely gonna die. And then they go holding hands like little sisters they are. Like, what's it called? Um, what is it called? God, what is that movie called? It's like Switched at Birth? Yeah, that's what it is. Switched at Birth. The one with like the two twin sisters that find each other. Is it Switched at Birth or? It's not Switched at Birth. <laughs> The rest is up to you, yeah. So he's just gonna go out on blades of glory in one last attack. Cause that's how it always is, boy. It always ends like that. Only 11 minutes and we actually finished all this, jeez. It's not bad. Yeah, this is as yet. Man, I gotta sneeze. Not now. I'm telling you, allergies are absolutely killing me. Kind of like how Barch just killed Golf right there. Now he's gonna hide the body by throwing it off into the ocean. Oh, he's going with them. So yeah, now they're... Now they're on... I don't remember the name. What's the name of this, um... Windrake. Yeah, he's not gonna be able to keep that promise anymore. He promised him he would, you know, go out with him, but... He ain't going out with him, but there you go. There's the first tower down. Or is that the only tower? I thought there was like towers all around, dude. Who knows? Oh, epilepsy warning again. Oh, nope, that was it. That was the only way I had to take it down. So you could actually get in from there through the submarine all along. But then you got this really somber tone again, like everybody, like always whenever you lose someone. This game always has death in it, but none of it really feels the problem I've always had was it never felt. Nothing ever really felt like it was like a loss, you know, it was kind of like, okay. Well, you know, golf lost his friend. It's like, yeah, go figure. Yeah, I guess we'll just rest up a bit. Just sleeps in the chairs just like that. Let's go ahead and sleep while our friend's grieving, right? So... So now, actually, I think you just have to wait here. <laughs> go figure. There we go. So now, yeah, you just had to wait a while. <laughs> yeah, trying to play a hero. That's not one. That's not a way to talk to your friend that just died. Calling him a bad word. Calling him a swears. Should be easy task to locate Guido's cave. A lot easier. That's right. I forgot. That sunk in episode 18, didn't it? He needs to rest. Yeah. Bars really did a number on when he punched him like that. Gave him a sucker punch that he got. So I completely forgot that his cave sank. But now we can go find it with the submarine. Oh, but first he's all sad here. He's... He's the second to last surviving, I think. Because Bart's dad's dead. The wolf... Oh, we can't go over that. The uh, werewolf is still alive, though. So... There's actually four places we can go with this. I'm actually only going to go to the Guido's cave because there's nothing else I can do up at those other dungeons right now. So, wait, look at that. You can see, like, it's like the continent map. I like this map much better. It's easier to see it. Like, which one's which or what's what. So, should I continue Guido's cave this episode? It's only been 14 minutes. I suppose I can. Or I can at least get there. <clears throat> and maybe end the episode there. Who knows? Who knows? I've been uploading, um, episode... Man, what episode is it that I was uploading? I think 18 of this? So, there we go. Now we're here at Guido's Cave. Oh, shoot. I didn't want to start a battle. What am I doing, dude? There we go. Alright, guys. Well, hey, I think I'm going to end the episode here. Thank you all so much for watching. Next time, we will go and find this sage Guido that sunk into the ocean back in episode... Or part, like... 
15? 14? Who knows? Thank you all so much for watching, and I will see you in the next video.